Hey guys, it's me, Melissa, and welcome back to my channel. Today we have another Dollar Tree haul. I think we're gonna start off with the DIY first and then move from there. Um, I don't know if you remember, but last time when I went to my mom's house and did the Dollar Tree haul, I got these right here and I told you I had six of them and I was going to make something hang on my wall, which I did. But now I kind of wanted more and I'm wondering if the screw will hold it, but I want to do more. So I bought three more when I found them at my Dollar Tree. They're really hard to come by. There's a Sterilite. Oh man, it's back to the bag. They're Sterilite, but they connect together. So what I thought I was gonna do is show you kind of how I connect them, then go upstairs and show you what's up there right now, how I've done it, and then add these ones and then fully set it up and have it totally good to go. So I'm gonna try to find an angle where I can show you me zip tying them together because I have the zip ties that I got the last time too. I'll figure this out. All right, guys, I'm all set up. So when you have these, you have two choices. You can have them looking longer ways or you can have them this way, being taller. I want them longer so a little more stuff. And then you connect them right where they have the connects and then zip tie. So pretty much all I did was take the two that are kind of closest to the top, like more, you know, right in the middle kind of top and zip tie. Hopefully you can see what I'm doing. Do them nice and tight. And before I cut this one, I go ahead and do the other one. Right through the bottom hole and the top hole. And then zip tie. You can do either way you want. I mean, it really doesn't matter what side you do it on. Trim them off. And now we already have two connected. And they're pretty sturdy. So then all you gotta do is take the third one, any side you want, connect that one on in, and then do the same thing. So I'm just gonna zip tie just like this. And then we go upstairs, all you have to do is now attach these back up to the other side, but to the other ones. Final one for the downstairs. And then cut, cut. All right, time to head upstairs. Okay guys, so here's what I'm working with right now. But as you can tell, I'm already utilizing the top. So it kind of felt like one more row would be great. Then I just fastened it behind here with what was already up there. Hopefully it's gonna hold. So now I'm just going to take the stuff off of the top, put it on, and then I have some more things I want to add to it. And then I'll show you guys. And here we go, guys. It's pretty simple. I mean, if I can do it, anybody can do it. I even didn't even secure as crazy this time. Like this time when I did the two right here, then I was like, you know what? I'm just going to do one right there. And then one right there. Whereas other ones, I went like crazy and did two on each side. I feel like it's secure. I pulled a little on the wall. Seems fine. I mean, only a couple other extra stuffed animals on here that wasn't before, but now I have more room to collect more stuff or I maybe mean, 90% of the stuff on here is stuff you guys have sent me. If you want a little tour, here we go. Over the years. I actually used one of those hooks from the Dollar Tree to hook that up just like a painting. <laughs> stuff over here. I mean, some stuff is stuff I bought, but most of the stuff is from you guys. There, these are the new ones. And then up top, I'm gonna do stuffies. All right, now back downstairs. I mean, thank you again, Barbara, for sending me that hack, because that was actually a DIY that I could make happen, and that makes my heart smile, because <laughs> I'm not good at DIYing. Now, the rest of the stuff is kind of oh, some things to go for my Poshmark, some other things, some things I'm gonna be using in a video. So I did pick up this, um, which I'm going to put my little postie that I got sent uh, for sub love in this. I'm going to hang it up. I'm just going to see if I have um, a hanger thingy. I think I do out there. Then I picked up one, two, three, four packs of thank you cards for my Poshmark. Um, these had six in it. These had eight in it. There was only two of these. 
So I grabbed the two of these and then two of these with the six. That should last for a little bit of time. Um, I'm actually going to cycle after that. I bought something off of Shein that I think I'm going to use instead of cards after that. Um, I also bought two packs of tissue paper for my boxes when I send them out. The colorful ones are prettier, but there's less in them for the same price. I think that like this has 35 sheets in each, and I think the other one had 25 or 26 in it. So I picked up two white because, I mean, in reality, people are just going to throw it away. It's just there to be a buffer <laughs> between your card and gifts and your other surprises. Then I thought it wouldn't be funny for the next round, which I think that by the time this video come out, comes out, the next round has already happened, I believe. Um, I bought these <laughs> blowers. They, what do they call them? Party blowers. Party blowouts. They call it party blowout. So I thought it would be funny to put one in each of the boxes to kind of be like, you're opening it up and it's like a party. Like, your party's here. <laughs> so, at least I'll have 21 people or what, 24 people to be able to get uh, one of these. I thought it was funny. I picked it up. And then my Dollar Tree, which I thought was strange because I was almost worried that these were going to be $1.25 each. They had them separated out of the, the bag. So I got picked up two for a future video that I'm going to do. Uh, a wish video. And they were $0.33 cents each. Not bad. Then I picked up a clipboard. I don't know. I feel like I should have a clipboard. I figure with all the stuff I do, it'd probably be handy if I had a clipboard. And I don't have a clipboard. So now I do have a clipboard. I don't know, like, if I have a piece of paper with stuff I need to remember for a video or if I need to write things down during a video on a big piece of paper. Because usually I write things down on, like, these little pieces of paper. And as you guys know, my handwriting is straight awful. So something that I can't even read what I wrote down. <laughs> And then I picked this up. Hurricane season is upon us. <laughs> I'm filming this before that uh, hurricane. This is a 2-in-1 flashlight and lamp. I know I'm going to get a battery. I still never could find the one that my mom got, which was like, wind up. That would be handy. Yeah, we're going to need batteries. So you got the LED kind of lights right here. And then a flashlight. Please don't need something big and crazy. Lime battery cartridge. Nope. We need doubles? Triples? Doubles? Triples? Don't know. I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out and be right back. I got it. It ended up being three AAA batteries. So keep in mind, I'm going to turn on a flashlight now. Uh, I believe you're going to go forward. Yeah, forward and it turns on the flashlight. Pretty decent right and then the opposite way and it turns on like a straight up light so if you want to like look at things this way instead of like this holding it like that i mean in florida flashlights are always handy to have i actually should go around the house and double check and see how all the flashlights are going because when you need them and they're not ready what's the point of having them <laughs> especially because some of them take like big old batteries, like C's. Who's got that around? Not me. <laughs> and then for the final item, thought I'd get something funny. Thought it kind of looked like chicken. Like a scary chicken, that is. <laughs> oh my, I didn't realize it was going to be like, like that. It looked like it was going to be a hard, a hard thing when it was in here. But it's like all silicone-y. Oh man. It's made for kids? Oh man, the smell of it. I didn't think it was gonna be like this. <laughs> Ooh, that rubber smell is uh, on point. How do you get it? You have to really move your mouth. Paco. Paco. Look at mama. What's mama doing? What are I doing? Doesn't care. <laughs> he doesn't care at all. Oh my gosh, I did not think it was going to be like this. <clears throat> Should I finish the video like this? Maybe it needs to be like lower. Then it'll move more. And now it moves a little better. Has to be underneath your chin. <laughs> 
Am I freaking anybody out right now? Huh? You freaked out? I'm kind of freaking myself out. <laughs> Let's finish the video like this. Why not? It'd be funny. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you have any comments or any questions, please put them down below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. If you hadn't yet subscribed, I mean, come on. Why not? <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day. I'll see you soon. Bye.